Greetings. We are the Syrian High Council. We are very pleased to be speaking with you today. As you move into this next phase of light, darkness has nowhere else to go but leave the planet or be dissolved by the light. The Earth and humanity are being engulfed with the cosmic light coming in from the recent solar eclipse, your astrological alignments, along with all the beautiful rays being amped, directed, and shared by your star families. Energy never stops moving. Once it is activated or projected, it begins a continuous vibration that can only be countered by other energies. So when you send loving vibration to your human families, those vibrations do not end when you stop sending them. They will eternally move and expand. Your intentional focus of these energies in the directing or projecting of them means that your love will engulf another as long as your energies are not countered by others' energies. Energy moves in waves, and when you have waves of love light engulfing a darker vibration, the higher light vibration will eventually distort, dissolve, and null the darker energy. The darker energy will eventually merge with the light, raising the darker energies to the higher vibrations. Just as a candle softens the darkness, your light does the same. When you walk into a room filled with different frequencies, your light begins to soften all other vibrations within your immediate space. As long as you allow your light to shine with focus, you are not disturbed by the lower vibrations. Those in dark or lower emotions will try and pull you down to the same level as them because your light will be uncomfortable for them. When you walk into a room with a smile on your face and a bounce in your step, and all others are in anger, hate, or fear, they wonder how you can be so high in light. They will first try and drop you to their level of vibration. If that doesn't work, they will, they will move away from you so they continue to wallow in the darker energies, or they will eventually begin to smile and become lighter themselves. Remember to never let the lower vibrations pull you down. You do have a choice. You also do not have to move away from the darker energies or lower vibrations as many believe they need to do. Your light energies are more powerful than any dark energies and will eventually change the vibration of your area to a positive aligned frequency. The light is very contagious. It just takes the spark of a loving smile to change the vibration of a situation. Energies are universal in nature, meaning they are polarized in high and low vibration. All energies are vibrations created from something or someone. Light and vibration are all that exists in our reality. Light being the consciousness of source creator and movement, sounds, or actions, which causes the vibration of that infinite light. You can choose where to be at vibrationally within this light spectrum of existence. The brighter your personal spark of light is, the higher in frequency it is, and the higher in the light spectrum you reside. The physical 3D reality that the Earth has just transcended was at the vibration of a very low continuous hum at 7.83 Hertz. At this moment in your time space, the Earth frequency is between 14 and 20 Hertz, which is double and beyond what was once her continuous state, meaning her vibration has risen past the third dimensional spectrum of vibration and has entered the fourth dimensional vibrations. With her frequency now at a higher vibration, all who reside with her must either move away from her or merge with her vibrations. This is why many souls are choosing to leave the planet in these moments. Humans emit vibrations out to the universe through their thoughts, words, and actions. Negative vibrations are also infinite and never end unless countered or dissolved by higher vibrations. In these precious moments, all dark energies around your planet are being dissolved and countered by the force of light. This includes the vibrations you are personally experiencing. It will become harder to hold on to any lower vibrational emotions such as anger or hatred. The light is penetrating you with the vibrations of love, dissolving or removing all desire to entertain the darker emotions. This is awakening humanity to their connection with spirit at a much faster pace. Many are waking up to all the deceptions and the dark's control. However, the main focus of the awakening is the remembrance of your light. 
so as the newly awakened remember their light, they must raise out of the lower vibrations. The first emotions one experiences are usually anger towards the deceivers and a push of energy towards freedom. However, that is just the beginning and is only the first shock of your awakening. At that moment, they are still very focused on the outer world of their existence. This soon leads to spiritual awareness. Once one looks within, they begin to remember that they are a spark of the great spirit of light. You are the light vibrating through your own personal emotions, emanating outward to the universe. The vibrations you emit are never ending and eternal. You choose what to send and receive back through the reflections of your thoughts, words, and action, which continue for an eternity. So be at peace, love, and joy, dear ones, for your light is brilliant. Share your love to all you encounter, and it will be with them for an eternity. We love you and celebrate your return to oneness. We are the Syrian High Council. Intuitive transmission by Chelia Wilder at universallighthouse.com. Thank you for watching Universal Lighthouse Galactic Messages and Spiritual Teachings. Please use your own personal discernment on all content posted. If you enjoyed the different authors that are shared, please subscribe to their content as well. You can visit our blog page at universallighthouse.com and subscribe to receive daily posts via your email. And while you are there, tune in to Universal Lighthouse Radio broadcasting 24-7 for your vibrational needs. Again, that's universallighthouse.com.